Oklahoma City, as the Thunder have struggled to find consistency and offensive rhythm this season, Carmelo Anthony has been at the heart of it as he adjusts to a new role and position in Oklahoma City. But on Friday, Anthony showcased the kind of offensive player coach Billy Donovan has been envisioning playing alongside Russell Westbrook and Paul George. With the majority of his looks, particularly from three-point range, coming in catch-and-shoot situations, Anthony scored 24 points on 8 of 19 shooting, including 7 of 12 from 3, in a 120-117 win over the Atlanta Hawks. 100%, Donovan said when asked if that was the ideal kind of offensive game for Anthony. I give him a lot of credit because this is different for him, and he's really been open-minded about trying to do whatever he can do to help the team. And as a coach, you really appreciate someone that's been in the game such a long time and established himself as a 10-time All-Star, 14 years in the league, one of the all-time greats, that he's willing to look at ways that he can do things a little bit differently to help our team. With the Hawks overcoming a 16-point second-half deficit to take a four-point lead in the fourth quarter, Westbrook and Anthony settled into a two-man game running a heavy dose of pick-and-pop as Anthony hit a series of crucial late jumpers. I think for me it's just a matter of accepting that role. That's all it is, Anthony said. Realizing that's what it's going to be, these are the type of shots I am going to get, this is the type of offense we're going to be running and accepting that, and working on that role. That's something that I've kind of been doing over the past week, is allowing myself to accept that role and do whatever I gotta do to make this team win. Anthony's seven made three-pointers and twelve three-point attempts were both season highs. I felt like during the course of the season, those opportunities were there, Donovan said, but we didn't have a good enough recognition or awareness of them, and I think we're really more mindful of locating him on the break, in penetration, to create those shots for him. And he's as good as anybody in the league when he's shooting behind the line. He's just a great, great shooter from behind there. Said George, he's one of the best in the league, and statistically over his career at catch and shoot. He's definitely a weapon. I know it's different for him, he's been so used to midrange and playing off the block and elbows, but he's a huge threat on catch and shoot. A focus for Donovan has been to reduce non-paint twos, as he likes to call them. That has meant trying to break some of the habits of Anthony, who had made a Hall of Fame career primarily in the midrange. But the Thunder saw Anthony as a stretch option, playing alongside George and Westbrook as a floor-spacing marksman. It has been a work in progress for Anthony, and he has talked often about sacrifice, intentionally making extra passes and seeing his scoring and attempts go down, but it's something he said he is gaining more clarity on. Just talking, communication, watching film, he said.